back to Gem Ray Cooks TV. Today on the last episode of my birthday series, I'm going to be making some nachos. Let's go into it. A handful of herbs. Here I have some coriander and chives. Juice from one lemon. Two ripe avocados. 400 grams of tortilla chips. 200 grams of cheese, 300 grams of sour cream, 300 grams of Doritos mild salsa. First of all, we're gonna take our avocados and we're gonna cut them out, take the seed out and take their skins out and put it into the bowl. Now using a fork, we are going to mash up these avocados until they are, you know, all mashed up and uh, it's kind of thick sauce. I have mashed up all of my avocado and now I'm going to cut these um, herbs into small pieces, just chop it up with this knife and then we can add that into our guacamole with our lemon juice, salt and pepper. So I've got my lemon juice, my herbs and my salt and pepper and I'm going to add it into my guacamole. And with the herbs, I'm not going to add all of it into the guacamole because the sour cream that I'm going to make, I'm going to add some into that just to add it a little bit more flavour. So add about half of this, maybe three quarters of this to the guacamole and leave the rest for the sour cream. Could I also just say another thing? That today is the day of my sleepover. So right now I'm preparing this guacamole fresh for the nachos that I'm going to make in about seven hours. Now that my guacamole is finished, I'm just going to pop it into the fridge to refrigerate so it can be nice to be able to be served in my sleepover. The sour cream is actually going to be very easy to make. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to add these um, herbs into this container where the sour cream is with some pepper and salt and just mix it with a spoon. So we're going to keep it in this container and then I'll refrigerate it ready for the nachos. We're going to head on to the cheese. The cheese grating is pretty straightforward. We're just going to grate the cheese. Once I've grated this cheese, I can show you how the assembly of the nachos will go. The assembly is pretty simple. Basically, we've got two plates inside two packets of tortilla chips. I'm going to put one packet per plate. Once I put the tortilla chips on the plate, I'm going to get half of the cheese, which I've grated, put it on top of one plate of the nachos and then the other half on the other. And then I'm going to get half of the salsa, put it on top, half of the sour cream and half of the guacamole. Pretty straightforward, but before I put on the guacamole, salsa and sour cream, I will melt the cheese and the tortillas in the oven for about five, seven minutes, just until the cheese is nicely melted and isn't burnt, but has a nice brownish to it. And then we can have the sauces and it'll be absolutely delicious. Sadly, I won't be doing the assembly now as in about six hours we're going to eat this, so I'm going to do it then so it's nice and fresh. Remember to like, subscribe, turn on the bell notification, and remember, keep on cooking!